What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Thank you so much for tuning in. It's me, Mikey Pipes. Sunday afternoon, 14th. Wow, it's way off. <laughs> 16th of February, 2025. Heading on an emergency service call in Rockville Center. We have a new residential client. It's got a Burnham Series 2 gas-fired hydronic boiler. Thermostat set for 70 degrees, yet it's only 51 inside his home. Let's go check out what's going on. Get him up and running. Are you ready? Let's go! All right. 17 minutes later. Grab my tool bag. How you doing, sir? What's going on? Use good. the front door, side door? Uh, come to the side. Side door? Yeah. Okay. What's going on? How you doing, sir? Thanks for coming. You got out. no heat, huh? Uh, sporadic. Right now, there's no heat, though. You look at it. Okay. But this morning, I got up. It comes on and off. Okay. On and off. Since yesterday, it's on and off. I don't know. The light's still left. Want there be light? There was light. So, oh, I have hot water though. We have a separate water heater for that. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, it comes on when it feels like it. This morning I got up, it was, I fit my hands. Ice cold. It's cold. cold. Freezing. Can't put the floors on, got radiant floors, can't put them on. So, the whole, the whole house, no heat? No heat. Well, you have hot water? I have hot water. Okay, let's see. Uh, yesterday. Boiler's was cold. About 100 and 110 degrees, maybe. Got some good pressure in there. So it started yesterday, huh? When's the last time you had any service on this thing? About maybe two, three years ago. And it's flashing twice. Ignition control. Let's remove 24 volts. All right, and let's go to 24 volts TH. And you get voltage there. appears as though you have a bad ignition module. Yep. 24 volts. Put this on. even a spark. Gas valve clicks. Hmm. All right, here is the new intermittent pilot ignition module. Similar to that one, except we have THW. We don't have THW on there. The 24 volt from the original goes on THW. And let's put this right there. Sorry. And we have ignition. Bad module. I removed TT from G, killing the call for heat. 
vent damper is closed. Let's reconnect. Damper opens. And then we'll have status on the module. There it is. Here comes tick. And ignition. All right, time for testo. Combustion analysis in progress. And it's never been done in this boiler because no one else ever drilled a hole here. We'll see what our numbers are in a few moments. All right, combustion test results, 436 stack temperature. That's higher than what it normally would be, but it's an older boiler, so it is what it is. Most important, oxygen, 7% is good. Parts per million of carbon monoxide, 23 is good. Efficiency, 81.1%. And if we go to scroll down to our CO2, 7.79, not too shabby. We have a nice blue flame down there and we are cooking with gas. Nicey nice. And we'll be at temperature shortly. So let's clipboard this, pull out our probe. Let's escape, let's go to draft. Let's measure everything before this boiler turns off at temperature, which will be shortly. That's gonna zero out for 11 seconds. It's sizzling. It's Blazing hot. Two, one, zero. Here we go. Negative pressure. We're going to put that back in there like that. And we're still going to have negative pressure. Now, there are some that say, oh, Mikey Pipes, you need to test it after the draft diverter. I was like, no, this is the way I was taught. And if you want me to test above that, we'll still have a good draft because I got my hand here and it's not burning. And that spill switch, she ain't tripped either. Negative pressure. Let's clipboard that. We'll print the results. Have a nice day. Oh man, my battery just died. No way, we're out of paper. Out of paper. Try again. Date and time is correct. And our numbers are all good. Perfect. No, I just needed to get in there that one screw here. Just it's, come on, right there. Hmm, nothing out of the ordinary with it, but then again, it's sealed box and plastic. And the boiler's from, oh, the boiler's 15 years old. So if that's the first time it's been replaced, not too shabby. Service tag, combustion test results, valve tag for boiler gas, boiler water supply, gas water heater, water supply for water heater, main water valve. You want to try that before you try that. That breaks, you're screwed. Try that first. All right, ladies and gentlemen, finished up this service call. Emergency, no heat. Easy peasy. And I gotta admit, you know, sometimes you leave a service call, and it's like, oh, just another job. Just another, just another service call, just another boiler we fixed. But the homeowner, really, really nice guy, older-ish gentleman, probably my age, uh, would never have guessed uh, when he asked for a uh, law enforcement discount. He didn't even ask for that. He asked for a first responders discount, and we do offer a 15% discount to our first responders, whether it's law enforcement, ambulance, EMT, fire department. Uh, you got to give credit to those guys. They don't earn enough. They really don't for putting themselves, their lives in jeopardy every single day. So it's really, really, really nice guy. You know, I'm very observant. As I say a lot in my videos, a good technician is observant of his surroundings. He's got two cars in the driveway. One car had a culinary arts like parking decal on the bumper. I'm like, oh, and then when I saw like the pasta press machine, I was like, oh, the guy's a chef. Got to be right nice beautiful kitchen you know professional like chef grade appli appliances i'm like i never would have thought that he was law enforcement <laughs> never but you know you leave those service calls where it's you felt good 
doing your job, doing your career, doing your profession. And that guy, awesome, awesome guy. Good stuff. All right, guys, remember, if you live in the Long Island, New York City metropolitan area, and you're tired of getting bamboozled by your HVAC contractor, I want you to pick up the phone and give me a call, 516-348-6300, or save time, book online at pipedoc.net. Remember, we do all phases of heating, cooling, refrigeration, water heaters, plumbing, all that good stuff, all that good stuff. Catch you in the next one. Be well, God bless, stay safe.